So I thought it would be fun for us to try the Waterboy Weekend Recovery. So I ended up getting this from Amazon. Honestly, it would have been way cheaper if I would have gotten it from TikTok Shop, but TikTok Shop was doing like a sale and I needed it sooner rather than later. Um, so that is why I ended up getting it from Amazon. So this is their brand new collaboration with FOW. I honestly, I don't know what that stands for, but this is their fruit punch. So if you know much about Waterboy, they're considered Liquid IV's like biggest competition because they are specifically meant for hangovers, bachelorette parties, bachelor parties. And this one is supposedly having three times more electrolytes than Liquid IV, nine times more electrolytes than the leading companies such as Cure Hydration and stuff like that. This has L-theanine, B12, ginger root, as well as um, magnesium. Magnesium is a thing that most people take when they're trying to go to sleep. Some people also take it for energy as well. But we're gonna go ahead and give it a little taste test in my cutie little thing. One of the main complaints that I saw on TikTok shop, um, I'll put the Amazon link if I like it, was that they thought it was too salty. I had the boyfriend try this already and he was tasting the fruit punch, a little bit of the salt, but he was more so tasting the mineral taste that you would normally get with something that is high in ginger root magnesium. So we're gonna go ahead and try. It does have a really strong fruit punch flavor, but I will say that I do get a very strong mineral taste. The salt isn't actually too bad. One of the big things that people like about this rather than um, liquid IV is that it's sugar-free. So that's big, as well as it has less calories as liquid IV. As someone who tries lots of liquid IV, I can tell you most of the time their stuff runs about 25 to 50 calories. This one's only 10. Um, overall, the taste is pretty good. It's very hard to find an electrolyte company that has absolutely no aftertaste. Honestly, of all of the companies I have tried, these are probably the only two flavors that I've had. What would you say, Nick? I think these are the only two flavors that I've had that had no aftertaste. This is the Liquid IV ice, uh, Popsicle Firecracker as well as the Rainbow Sherbet. Yeah. But I have had um, Liquid IV before that has had an aftertaste, right, Nick? So, yeah. I'll link everything down if you guys are interested because technically the Rainbow Sherber one is popular for good reason on TikTok because um, this one's sugar-free and has no aftertaste. But this one has a little bit of an aftertaste. The boyfriend didn't mind it, um, but he says it's definitely more um, mineral taste rather than salt. So. I feel like honestly for the ingredients that they put in it, I feel like it's a pretty good value because ginger root and magnesium as well as L-theanine are in a lot of really good health supplements. So that's what I like about it. Um, but yes, definitely go check it out. 